What should you do if you found out that you failed to take your required minimum distribution or your RMD from your retirement accounts? You know, the, the law on RMDs has been changing a lot the last few years. So I think it has created a lot of confusion and the penalty for failing to take RMDs is one of the more significant ones the IRS gives. So we're gonna talk real quick what to do if you found out that you failed to take yours and how you can potentially get the penalty waived. My name is Scott Caulfield, I'm a CPA and a CFA charter holder and the founder of Sophos Wealth Management. So the first thing to do is correct the remedy the error go take that RMD ASAP. So um, if you haven't done it before, some of your custodians are gonna go ahead and calculate it for you, but you'll take your the initial value of all your accounts at the beginning of the tax year and multiply it or divide it by a uh, factor that comes from the IRS based on your life expectancy. That will tell you how much your RMD was supposed to be, and I would take it as soon as possible. Now, once you've taken that RMD, you are gonna go ahead and want to report it when you file your taxes, report the failed RMD. So you'll file form 5329 with the IRS. This is where they will calculate your penalty. Now the penalty used to be 50% of the failed RMD or missed RMD was a tax penalty. Very punitive, one of the biggest ones out there. It's been reduced to 25%, but that is still significant. Um, Fortunately, this is an area where the IRS can grant you penalty abatement, so they can waive that penalty. You need to show that the error was due to a reasonable cause. Maybe it was your first R&D, you're brand new, maybe you had a sickness that year. Um, we have to give them a reasonable, um, reasonable cause for why you missed it. And you know it's gonna be in the judgment of the IRS agent or whoever's reviewing your case, whether your uh, reason you know, makes sense or not. Additionally, you wanna show the corrective actions. So step one, having taken the RMD is the best way to go here. You can say, hey, my bad, this is my very first RMD. I didn't know I was subject to it with the years moving around. You know, It used to be 70 and a half when you had to take it and then it was, uh, 72, now it's 73. And so, you know, that can co create confusion. And I think it's reasonable to say, hey, yeah, I just missed it, but I took it as soon as possible. Show them that you've remedied it and good potential that you'll get that penalty waived. So that is definitely what I would try if, if I had missed it. Um, thanks for tuning in. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to visit my website and like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks a lot.